Alright guys, welcome back to some more Fallout to New Vegas. Now, there's a couple things here we can do. First, I'm gonna get this med kit. There's usually like no, there's like no stim packs in this game. Like in Fallout 3, you find so many stim packs. Oh, I found two. How lucky. I don't know, I usually, I remember getting a quest from Lieutenant Hayes saying to clear out the freaking area, but he never gave it to me when I played this. So he should be here somewhere. He should be in here. There he is. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? What are you doing out here? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. That place sucks. As you can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. What's the problem with your mission? The mission isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. Convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but <coughs> shit. Things are just going slow. Okay, tell me about the correctional. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. That place sucks. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. Yeah, I think we might want to go there later for the quest we're doing right now, but I don't think I'm strong enough yet. Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers, mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought. Most of them. Why would you give ex-convicts explosives? Here seem to split off from the main force, so they How does that make any sense? Way of support. I have some other questions. Oh, nothing. It doesn't give us anything. I think we have to be in good terms with them in order for you to get anything. And I don't. I can't steal from that. Okay, so our next objective is to, I guess, continue on with the main quests. That away. Uh, I think we have to free some people. Oh, is my speech high enough? I think I have to have 50. Shit. I knew it. Let me. Where, where is it? What's my speech? Th 35. Do I have anything for that? I think I could take maintenance, maybe? Let me see. Yeah, charisma, plus one. I might I might do that, we'll see. Uh, I think I might have, do I have apparel for charisma? Speech, plus two, yeah, I'll take that too. Because there's a guy later on. I'm trying to maximize am the amount of experience I can get. I mean, it doesn't really matter in the whole scheme of things, but I'm trying to level up, level up as fast as I can. Don't turn around. <laughs> he doesn't even know. Okay. Oh, there's landmines here. Holy shit. Totally forgot to. Landmine right here. You can walk up to them and just disarm them. There you go. And you get experience for it, too. So there is a couple enemies here. I think first you want to head into the casino before anything else. Uh, I want to check what's over here first. Never been this way. Is that boarded up? I think it is. This guy up there. Yeah, looks that looks closed. Or is it? Never tell with this game. This does look closed. It is closed. God damn it. Alright, I'm gonna run. Okay. I think I'm fine. So, yeah, we, we want to head inside the casino real quick. Before we go in there, Mojave Express. Sure, there is a couple enemies here. My, my weapons are garbage. I think these guys are using varmint rifles also. So, I ain't even worried. God damn, I can't aim. Cut it out, God damn, my gun sucks. <laughs> I'm gonna try this varmint rifle. <laughs> this gun is garbage, too. 
This thing is shitty. Get him. Ooh, backward. Oh, where's my shotgun? It's a three. Yep. What's this dude trying to run? What the fuck? Cripple your damn leg. I'm hit. Ain't going anywhere, son. Dude, trying to run away. What a bitch. I'm hit. No, I might want to kill that guy. He has a sniper. I believe. Hmm. Let's do it. I'm gonna run up to him and shock him in the face. So I ain't got no damn patience. Wait. Oh, actually, I can't. Because the damn bridge is broken. Shit. Well, might as well kill him now. Whatever. See if I can sneak up on him. There might be a might be a lot of people up here. Or not. Can you climb this? Oh you can. Sweet Jesus. Come on. Fucker. Let me search you. Oh he had a varmint rifle? I thought he had a sniper. That's useless. You suck, guy. Okay. Let's head inside the casino. I think we're good. Hey, one thing I didn't mention is the repair. You see how uh, weapons have like a th like there's a bar. That is the maximum amount you can do. Once it goes past the bar on the left, like this weapon, let's see, they have a bad. I think my yeah my revolver goes past the left side. If it's past that, that means it's breaking. Obviously. Past the right side, that means it's still in good condition and does a maximum amount of damage. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. Uh, okay. Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby Nash. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. I am a courier with the Mojave Express. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I lost a package I was supposed to deliver. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? Yep. Oh, so you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over. But we couldn't turn down the caps. Uh, some men stole my package. A man checked her suit. Some thugs. Did they pass this way? Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. Hmm. One of the men shot me. I need to know the best way to get to Well, them. for that, your best bet is going Deputy to be talking Beagle. to Deputy Beagle. My kind Since of town. they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on him, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. Okay. That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. He canceled? Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around, asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, let Courier 6 carry the package, that's what he said. Like the Mojave sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. I forget who that actually is. Is that, I think that's Ulysses? It might be. 
Um, do you know where he went? No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that and turn down the money too. It's a, it's a DLC thing. Hope you didn't thing. see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Enough for me to say. Okay. Nope. Different fella. Bigger. Had himself a face on a screen. And he talked more like you or me. Okay, cool. Oh. Alright. Uh, Deputy Beagle's here. Oh, that's not him. Never mind. Please. The fuck am I talking about? There is a gun in there. SMG I want to get, but it's tricky because you have to pickpocket, picklock that. And you get caught if you do. Damn it, I was trying to lock her out so I can steal from the safe. Um, so yeah, we have to rescue the deputy. Guess we should do that. So we have a side quest. Let's see. Uh, do, do, do. Yeah, find the lawman. So we have to go to the bison and save his ass. She's hole up. I want to go in there so bad. I'll come back. I don't know if these guys sleep. What time is it? 7 p.m. Damn it, I don't want to wait. Shit, press the wrong button. Alright, let's go into the, the bison, oh. Steve. Oh, is there a bed here? I don't think so. Whatever. Let's go inside. I'll use my pistol. And then there's a, there's a flamethrower guy in here, so you want to be careful. Definitely want to be careful. Because he will fuck you up. Come on. He's running like a bitch. Damn, my stink's that low that he spotted me as soon as I walked in. That's garbage. Yeah, you can't lock this because my science isn't high enough. Damn it. Where's my shotgun? I'm gonna fuck him up. That dude straight up ran like a bitch. I won't want to find me anyways, whatever. Yeah, the music in this game is creepy. Oh my god. Yeah, I think here is a secret gun that you can get if your lockpick is high enough. Which I think for hard you need 75. You like that? Damn, I missed. You like that, bitch? I headshotted. Oh god. Another guy here? I don't see him on my help. Oh, there he is, he's coming. Shh. He has fucking dynamite. Who's there? Shotgun, bitch. Oh damn! Uh -huh. Oh, did he throw dynamite? Oh, thank God, that would have sucked. Okay, I think we're good for now. I keep thinking sees crouch because I've been playing Far Cry. So bottle caps, thank you. Oh, that's a book. I would refrain using from using the books for now until you get that perk where you can gives you double the amount of skill points. Yeah, do you need 75? Yep, 75. You can use mentence or something to increase your lockpicking. Where's this light coming from? But I would not advise it. Take his pistol. He has biker goggles. My old water, I'll take his dynamite. Why not? Okay. This place is creepy. You could take the easy way out and go up the elevator, but I think you need repair 25. Oh, 35, excuse me. <clears throat> now, I know there's a couple guys over there, that's where, you actually, that's where you actually have to go. Oh, 
gaps in the middle. Oh god. Come and get it. I'm gonna wait right here. Line up the headshot. Yeah, this is the back way. Back way. Uh, let's go kill that fucking scorcher guy before anything else, because he is a pain in the ass. He's in there. Oh, he sucks. What's this way? Ooh, Mentence. Just what I needed. I remember, I remember playing this mission on the first time I played this game, and uh, I fucking I ran around this corner to search the maintenance like thing, and the guy freaking oh he was right behind me it was ridiculous. There's two guys here. Where's the flamethrower guy? Did the flamethrower guy? Is that the flamethrower guy? I don't know. What just ducking, ducking cover? Oh, that's him. Oh, God, I'm crippling myself. Jesus. Yeah, I have to use a doctor's bag. God damn it. Yeah, might as well heal. I don't want to die. I like them apples, bitch. Where'd this guy go? There he is. Okay, thanks for the money, bottle caps, dynamite, stimpack. Thank you. I will take the Scorcher. The one thing I do like about this game is, uh... Oh, I thought that was a book. Is the fact that guns is all one thing now, so... In Fallout 3, there was big guns, and then there was like guns, guns. So I mean, you have to level up two things. Now it doesn't really matter, because every guns is all one thing. I will equip this flamethrower. Where is it? Repair this. Incinerator. Uh, I'm gonna take out my revolver probably. Actually, no, I'll take a dynamite. Need that shit. Oh. Incinerator's energy weapons, excuse me. Right, I think this guy is right here. Yep, there he is. I think he can he can die, by the way. Cause if you talk to him and you have your speech high enough, he will follow you, like be a companion for this one quest. And if you keep exploring upstairs, he can actually die. I think. I don't know. Let's talk to him. I don't suppose you... You must be Deputy Beagle. Why, yes I am. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most appreciative if you'd set me free. My friend, hold on, my friend's texting me. Uh, hold on. Uh, I hear you may have information on, on some con. Sorry about that. I was texting Indeed my friend. I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you. Life comes a knocking. Captivity. <laughs> oh, I need 40? Let me see. I might be able to pull that out. Let me save real quick. Okay. Uh, I can probably wear this. And then take a mentant. That might be overkill, but. It would be so big. I'm 39 oh my god it's so close it's so close fuck god fuck that nonsense I'm gonna quick load that's a waste I'll come back for your ass am I about to level up if I am I'll just upgrade my skills mm, that's cutting it close we'll see I'll head upstairs and kill the guys upstairs see if I can level up uh, as I said you can't take, you can't take the elevator 
My timer went off? Damn. Yeah, this is the way. Alright, so I'm gonna make a new video right here. And in the next part, I will see you when we clear the upstairs of the Bison Steve Hotel. Thank you for watching.